Approach control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector into birth. Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a Council Spectre aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. That's far enough. Something wrong, officer? You better hope there isn't. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Ilanis Risk Control Services. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, ma'am. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Novaria. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. Citadel authority supersedes yours. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three- Captain Matsuo, stand down! We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini-san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. Get out of here. I'll be keeping my eye on you. You're not so tough. You better toe the line here. I'm sure Parasini-san will answer any questions you have. Turians don't like the cold, Shepard. Did I ever mention that? A bit nippy. Weapons detectors! Don't mind the phones! I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Saren's aide is here. Passed through? Where is she now? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. That's where I need to be then. You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I'm not here to dig out any corporate secrets. 
That's gratifying to hear. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. Welcome to Port Hanshan, the galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety and to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. If you have questions or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you and enjoy your stay. Hmm. The managers warned us about you. I can't believe the paranoids that work here. There's no accident on Peak 15. This one offers greetings. You are the Spectre that visits Port Hanchan. News travels fast here. Indeed, esteemed Spectre. Your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. This one has a burden that you could ease. If an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it through customs. You want me to use my status to smuggle for you? That is not inaccurate. I won't carry anything if I don't know what it is. This one must be discreet. Rest assured, the contents pose no threat to anyone within this port. I want to know where this package is going. This one's customer prefers to remain anonymous. Deniability. He's not stupid then. Good. This one is humbly grateful that the Spectre understands. Are you gracious enough to perform the task for this one? I have no problem with that. This one humbly thanks the Spectre the package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy... fees. Is there anything else this one might help you with? I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits your return.
Wish we could pop off some incendiaries. Good day, Commander. I trust you are behaving yourself? Not mixing yourself up in any questionable activities? I don't generally get involved in that sort of thing. No, of course. I thought you'd be too intelligent for such a thing. If you were, I would have to recite some tedious speech, then ask you to leave. Just so we understand each other. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> you first. I'm just a security guard. I heard that there were no human specters. How did you get that job? My crew and I were involved in Saren's raid on Eden Prime. You disabled the nuke. That makes sense. Special Tactics likes people who can think on their feet. I served in the Marines for a decade, mustered out and went private sector. I was under fire a few times, so I ended up leading this detail. There are guards everywhere. Are there that many problems here? I am sure Parasini-san gave you the ultra-special blah-blah about business here. Everyone wants to be protected from everyone else, but everyone also thinks they have a special right to kick over everyone else. So you have to keep them from getting too eager. Most of my job is diplomacy. Two corps start yelling at each other, my people walk in, flash some ceramic, and they start talking civilly. If there is anything this job has taught me, it's how to be impartial. Don't they have their own security forces? <sighs> Everything from hackers to mercenaries. They have investments to protect, after all. But we are the only ones allowed to bear arms. Which is why the companies constantly try to bribe my people. I have a clear policy against freelancing. Anyone who works on the side is fired. Why are you still here? Are you guarding my ship? All of the companies have secrets. Some of them deal in things that are not quite legal. Having a Spectre here makes them nervous. Analea Sama is buried under petitions to kick you off world. Then you're actually protecting Normandy from the companies. I am protecting them from themselves. They do not have the personnel or training to assault an Alliance frigate. I'll be moving on. Very good, Commander. Please stay out of trouble. Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? I want to know where this package is going. This one's customer prefers to remain anonymous. Deniability. He's not stupid then. Good. This one is humbly grateful that the Spectre understands. Now, does the other have the package? Here you are. The Spectre has done a great service for this one. From the deepness of light, it thanks you. This one promised compensation for services rendered. It humbly suggests that a sum of 250 credits would be most appropriate. 250, huh? The Hanar government is communistic, right? 
Then this business is concluded. Is there anything else the other should like? Show me what you're selling. Of course. How can I help you? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas? Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine, come in. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain space-born vagabonds. I see you looked up my service record. Only a fool enters negotiation without knowledge of the other party's tendencies. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. Are you telling me you have no safety protocols? Don't be ridiculous. Do you think a for-profit company would take no precautions against loss of life and material? Project leads have the final say here, not meddlesome politicians. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Benezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self-explanatory. Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, mainly Asari commandos. Commandos? You didn't think that odd? They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. What can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. I'd like to see her. Immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. Surface access, you say? Cut off, I said. The roads are not suitable for travel. Don't make an issue of this, Shepard. Forget him, Commander. If he won't play ball, I'm sure someone else here will. What brought her out here? If I knew, I wouldn't be at liberty to say. She came here as Agent Saren's executor. Excuse me, his what? Executor. Saren is a major shareholder in Binary Helix. Lady Benezia is authorized to act in his name. She is here on business for Binary Helix. There were issues at Peak 15 that required Saren's attention. Back to my other questions. Every minute of my time you waste costs the company 12 credits. I will keep a running tally. Do you do business with Saren? I believe I explained this already, did I not? He is a major investor in Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. Is there some problem on Peak 15? An area of severe weather has cut off contact. Things will return to normal in a few days. I have no more questions at this time. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. Mr. Analeas isn't the only one with a pass to leave Henchan. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon through bureaucracy. All right. What would you do? Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not within earshot of Mr. Analeas. You said I should talk to Lorik Keen? Mr. Analeas isn't the only one with a pass to leave Hanchan. 
Keen spends his days at the hotel since his office was closed. I hear there was an accident on Peak 15. We're aware of the rumors. At the moment, contact with the facility is down due to weather. All employees should review their non-disclosure agreements and avoid irresponsible free talk. What kind of weather cuts modern communication? A blizzard is sweeping the Scotty Mountains right now. Between the cloud cover and heavy snow, the satellite uplinks are cut. What corporations work on Peak 15? Binary Helix has leased the entire complex. So, everyone shut up and keep your heads down? Loose lips sink third quarter profits. You have a more blunt way of speaking than is common here, Commander. How large are the facilities here? We have 17 research complexes built into the mountains. Each is a self-sufficient facility housing a staff of hundreds. Tell me about the companies that work on Novaria. Over 250 high-tech firms rent our labs. Major shareholders include Elanis Risk Control Services, Binary Helix, and Synthetic Insights Limited. Binary Helix, they work in genetics? BH is a leader in genetics and biotechnology. They try to keep a low profile in the media. Much of their research is in biotic modifications. That angers many Luddite, organic baseline, and fundamentalist groups. Haven't I seen synthetic insights in the news lately? They're one of only four corporations licensed by the Citadel Council to develop artificial intelligence. They attract many protests. No agitators have ever breached our security. That's why they invest heavily here. Your guards work for ERCS, don't they? The executive board gets a discount on facility security. Ilanis also develops lethal and non-lethal weapons. I've taken up enough of your time. Not at all, Spectre. This is my job, after all. regret letting you keep those guns. We've got a secret weapon. Sergeant Sterling's a biotic, and not a real friendly one either. The male human at the hotel bar? He's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are, Dullstone. That makes you ideal for my job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your, my, real intentions. He's right there. Why not talk to him yourself? I wish I could. I already bungled this myself. He realized I was not a real buyer. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What's your interest in Binary Helix? They do genetics work. Much of BH's work relates to biotics.
there are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance, discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500 credits. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here is the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'll go see him now. I hope to hear from you soon. Mr. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard, a Spectre. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Rafael Vargas, Sales. Were you interested in our services? I might be. That depends on what sort of offer your company can make. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. We can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide an 8% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. Is it possible to deaden pain somehow? What? Why, uh, we, we could try to make the skin insensate, I suppose. Full body numbness, atrophy out all the nerve clusters, you'd still feel internal injuries. But that's dangerously close to genetic engineering, Shepard. The laws only allow improvement of natural functions. We can't add or remove. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. For a bulk order, I can work in a sensory enhancement package, guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. I'll make sure that's in my report. The bean counters back at HQ can figure out the details. You know what I'm saying? I'm beginning to. It's obvious you have no knowledge of genetics, which makes it highly unlikely you were sent by the Citadel. A level with you. I was hired to break into your network. An agent of the Aramali Council gave me this. A cracking device. Full of viruses, I expect. Our IT people can isolate them, use them to feed the Asari false data. I'm disappointed in you, Commander. I thought your kind were above this sort of thing, if you'll excuse me. Any results? Everything went as planned. You should see results soon. Excellent. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. Only 500? All right. I thought you might have wanted to provide more. Since you couldn't do it yourself, I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. 
Good day, Spectre. Afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Are you Lorik Keen? I've heard you might be able to help me. You are the Spectre that just arrived, are you not? What can an old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office. For the moment, at least. Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. By rents, you mean bribes for Analeas? Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas's actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Why didn't Analeas cancel your pass clearance? Why should he? There's nothing outside but snow and hungry Nathak. How did you get a pass? I'm a manager. Most executives on Novaria are free to come and go as they will. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas's thugs may be necessary. He has members of Hanshan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. If he's paying them under the table, they're mercenaries. I can kill mercenaries. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep bloodstains off the carpets, would you? If you don't, you might end up like Laura Keene. Hanshan Security, this office is sealed. Laura Keen gave me a pass in. Keen? Are you working for him? He's under investigation. Stand aside, kid. Unlike most people you face, we're armed. 
You want to cause trouble?
I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. No, I'm not. Are you? I'm Sergeant Kyra Sterling, Ilanis Risk Control Services. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? Your men are dirty, Sergeant. You're here off duty, breaking the law for bribe money. I didn't want to fight them. They fired first. Well, I don't need a gun to rip you to pieces. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? Speak plain. What's your interest? Not here, Spectre. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting.
Someone murdered our people in the Synthetic Insights office. Wonder who could have done that. Sergeant Sterling was killed. When we get the one responsible, we'll take turns guarding them. Allow me to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. What do you want? The executive board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. Why don't you ask Keen directly? I'm Analeas's secretary. You'd think he'd believe me? That he'd meet me in some dark alley with his evidence? I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. The rule is don't rock the boat. Self-interest is tolerated if it doesn't interfere with business. Analeas is driving customers away. You work for Analeas. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, this month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analeas' guilt in one package. I need Keen's garage pass to complete my mission. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. Analeas is dirty. It might be best to help her. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You Spectres play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. Keen is offering to pay me. Can you? I can produce a copy of Analeas's pass for you. I can't move large sums of money without someone noticing. You gave me the company line about P-15. What's the truth? Before the weather closed in, Hanshan received a Code Omega signal from him. Code Omega means a terminal breach of safety protocols. No one goes up until the crew sends an all clear. And if the crew never sends an all clear? The executive board votes whether or not to destroy the facility. One antimatter warhead from the battle stations vaporizes all contaminants. That doesn't tell me much. That's all I've got. No one knows what's going on up there. How can I get to Peak 15? The shuttles are down, so you'd have to drive up. If you get keen to testify, I'll get into the garage. Do you know why the Matriarch is here? Something to do with Peak 15. She arrived after we received their Code Omega, automated warning of a containment breach. She came with an escort of Asari commandos. They took the last shuttle up to Peak 15 with a load of crates. Do you know what she had in the crates? No idea. The commandos wouldn't let anyone near them. They seemed heavy, though. I'll consider it and get back to you. If you have any love for the law, you'll talk to Keen for me. Don't disappoint me. You know where I work. Come talk to me when you change your mind. Spectre, right? Management told us not to talk to you. They say there hasn't been an accident on Peak 15, but everyone knows. What sort of office did they reach? Good. I don't think I'm supposed to mention numbers. They only write them down on thin strip. Full benefits, of course. Ah, oh, sure. The company takes care of its own. Full insurance, paid vacation, subsidized housing. After a year, I'd start getting stock options. You hear about the resort then? At the equator? 
bounce backing, diving, accredited as a Eurofield. I feel like that sort of thing. I'd rather admire the view. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. I had to ask. If you're not willing, here's the evidence. I appreciate your discretion. I hope I will never again be so careless as to find myself in these circumstances. I believe you require a garage pass. As well, I would provide a sum of 500 credits. Does uh, that sound fair to you? Not as fair as it could be, but it'll do. I'm grateful for your help. My office will reopen with much improved profit margins, I dare say. I have some calls to make, starting with Mr. Analeas. Insights is open again. I wonder what the closure was about. Peak 15 has bio and cyber hazard labs. If there is a problem, they should nuke it before it spreads. I'm sorry. The hotel is off limits to those without a corporate account. I can't let you in. You're welcome to enjoy a drink at our cafe. Don't hang up. Elder brother, it's me. I'm on the Varia now. I can't talk long. This call is costing 10 credits a minute. It's real time from the Traverse. Do you think it would be cheap? I need some information. There's an issue here with synthetic insights. The manager, Laura Keen, got caught with his toes wet. The office is closed by Hanshin's administrator. Uh, I need you to see what you can find out about. Are you ready for his name? Ronadril Gan Swa Fosun Keratin Nar Ead Bel Amaleus. No, that's the administrator. The Hanshin administrator. Well, think about it. A Turian wouldn't risk getting his office closed. They don't compromise their team. That's drilled into them from boot camp. I think the administrator is using this keen fellow to draw flies from his own clutch. Of course I could look it up myself. But do you think I'm likely to get any unfiltered data through Novaria's own network? That, and it would take forever for any out-system search results to get back here. Thank you, Elder Brother. I have to go. Yes. I'll speak to you soon. Beat it. I said beat it! Find something else to do, stupid mammal. If you don't stop poking me, I'll throw you off that balcony. We limit access to protect the privacy of our customers. Chilly today. They should put some mirrors in orbit, focus some sun down here to warm it up.
You're the Spectre, right? Um, management told us not to talk to you. The managers warned us about you, Spectre. I can't believe the paranoids that work here. There's no accident on Peak 15. They say there hasn't been an accident on Peak 15, but everyone knows. I heard some of the guys were ransacking synthetic insides. Captain Matsuo didn't order that. My sergeant was killed in the SI office. I don't know how I feel about that. She was brutal. How may this one assist? Show me what you're selling. Of course. I don't understand why those guys were in the Synthetic Insights office. You know what I could go for right now? A donut. Spectre, have you given any more consideration to my offer? I decided to take Keen's reward. Sorry. This was the best opportunity I've had in... Why did you sell it? You underestimated Novaria's code of silence. Keen wouldn't rock the boat, no matter what assurance I offered. Son of a bitch! This is what I get for entrusting it to a Spectre. What'd you do? Hold a gun to his head and order him to do it? God. Get out of here. I, I need to see if I can salvage anything from this. I do not want to spend another six months wearing this outfit. Commander Shepard, I have issues I must deal with now. I would prefer not to be disturbed. Commander Shepard, I have issues I must deal with now. I would prefer not to be disturbed. I've got a lot of work to do. Spectre, right? Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military tech. Except for my ego's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. So what can I do for you today? You seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights was shut down by Analeus. And the matriarch came through. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Never cut the satellite uplinks before. Fifteen's always had a lousy reputation. Nobody talks about what they do there. And everyone sent up comes back a little quieter. What was that about synthetic insights? Analeas had shut down SI. Looks like he was trying to blackmail them. It happens often enough. I guess he went too far this time. SI is open again, and Laura Keen is strutting around looking all smug. What do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshan. Just call me Lee. 
Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got a team of 12 under me, keeping the shuttles coming and going. I have to go. You need anything, I'll be here. Access to the garage is restricted. I have authorization. Excuse me. Yes, that's genuine. Drive safely. The weather's supposed to be pretty bad out in the Alutsk Valley. <laughs>